welcome back to the channel guys um, so today bit noisy next door today uh, I'm going to uh, where's that Anku Anku Reservoir so it's uh, we're situated down the bottom of um, the old walled city here so we're going up to the northwest um, the other side of the airport um, get some lunch there's a cafe up there by the reservoir so go check that out and um, yeah it's about uh, eight eight point one kilometers yeah so that's sort of where we're that's where we're going so uh, we'll jump on my bike and um, we'll head out there um, on that route quite often there's a police checkpoint so uh, been pulled up there before um, so if you're coming over here uh, the, the, the Thai law is that you must have a motorcycle license in your home country so no good uh, having you know like uh, New Zealand Australia England where you have a motorcycle license that allows you to ride a scooter in Thailand you must have a motorcycle license and um, and with that you must have a uh, international driver's permit and if you don't you'll get an instant fine on the side of the road uh, a lot of foreigners think it's um, you know briberies going on and all that but I think it's um, you know Thailand wants to um, stop foreigners dying on, on motorbikes in Thailand. They've got a bad road death um, tally in Thailand and I think there's about 500 foreigners a year killed on motorbikes so so that's the reason that the cops want to um, make sure you, you, you've got your right licenses, same as any country, follow the laws. Um, so yeah, the uh, motorcycle rental people, they don't ask for your license, they don't care, they just want your money and uh, away you go, so uh, so yeah, you need your international driver's permit, which uh, you get from your automobile association in your country, in New Zealand it cost me about $40, they done it uh, there on the spot, took about 10 minutes, um, and um, yeah, you can be fined $40 every time you get pulled up. So I've been pulled up twice in Chiang Mai now, and uh, I'll just whip out my international driver's permit, and on my way I go. So, uh, yeah, it's a bit cloudy today, which is perfect for uh, riding, so don't get too hot. So, yeah, away we go. Yeah. 
there's the uh, Chiang Mai Hills up there covered in a bit of fog. usually up here that they have some uh, police checkpoints so we'll see if they do Hello, Swarika. Uh, oh, sorry. Yeah, sorry. Nice and peaceful.
So the Chiang Mai Zoo is just over there. Maybe I'll go to that one day. So I'm going to leave it there guys, uh, walked around the lake, uh, the lake it's got a footpath about two thirds of the way around and then it's just a free for all, you just take whichever, whichever route you want. Uh, so the lake lake's up there and uh, that's where I started from, walked around, right around and all the Chiang Mai uh, University campus is all here and uh, yeah I just walked through that. But, uh, Hope you uh, enjoyed the video, uh, give me a like and a subscribe down below and I'll see you on the next video.